Give me, give me more. Give me fresh for more. Give me, yeah, you get the point. Hi there, I'm Melda from runningexpert.com and I'm here with the new balance fresh foam more V4. Wow, what a shoe. When you first try the more V4, you just want more V4. And as the name uh, indicates, it is just a max cushioned daily trainer with more foam. And don't get fooled by the stack height. It looks very, very, very tall. It is a high stack height, 34 in the heel and 30 in the front, which makes it a four millimeter drop. But there's also foam going upside each side of the foot, which, makes the, um, which creates kind of a nest for your foot, which is so comfortable and also creates a little bit stability for your foot and your landings. This is just a nice, nice shoe. I really enjoyed testing this shoe. It is Fresh Foam X all the way, which uh, is a very soft compound and also a doable compound which is uh, very nice and makes the shoe go for a lot of kilometers. I just came back from an injury and this is a very, very uh, nice and delightful for my, uh, for my heel and for my uh, Achilles. Um, yeah, I would just recommend this shoe if you need a max cushion daily trainer. The upper is quite standard New Balance. It is a, a soft engineered mesh, a little bit stretch, and then it's strengthened here around the foot, which makes it possible to tighten the shoe a little bit more. And for me, that's needed because of the wide platform the shoe is made on. And I think the wide platform is a little bit of a genius idea from New Balance because some of these Max Cushion trainers is, uh, yeah, they have a lot of soft compound and, um, and then it makes it a little bit unstable uh, in your landings. But because of the white platform, you feel quite stable in your landings. But that also requires that you need to uh, tighten your, the laces a little bit more. Um, and when I tighten my laces uh, very tight, I have a normal foot, not white, not narrow. But when I tighten uh, the laces, I still got a lot of space in the toe box. So it, it is a nice uh, daily trainer, not a competition shoe or anything like that. As you see on the outsole, there's a lot of rubber and uh, that makes the shoe very doable. Also, not heavy, but uh, not that light either. It has this, uh, what do you call a swall tail or something like that um, here, which makes the, the outsole goes, go out in your in, uh, when you land and then kicks back in your set off. And uh, that's also, that also gives a little bit of stability and, uh, and then, yeah, some respons responsiveness. It is a, a max cushion soft shoe, as I said many times now, but it also have a little bit of responsiveness, and I really enjoy that. I am um, I'm not that light of uh, I'm not a light runner. Can you say that? I'm not a thin light runner, so I'm a little bit heavy, and I sometimes feel that the max cushion shoes have tend to soak me into the ground and not kick back. And I need a little bit of kickback. So um, when I'm going out for the for the easy jogs or uh, a long, uh, slow run, I need a shoe which is uh, soft in my landings, but also gives me a little bit back when I uh, when I set off. And this shoe does the work. I will really, really recommend you to try out this shoe if you need a Max Christian daily trainer. This is just, when you just first try this, you want more V4, as I said before. Yeah. You can go find this in several colors on runningexpert.com. Um, yeah, go check it out. I will also put a link in the description. Until I see you next time, run good.